This is non-calculator question number 12 from the April 2019 SAT. If you have not already solved this problem, please pause the video for a moment and find your solution. Come back in about 90 seconds and compare your solution to my solution. And I forgot to sketch their actual line. So I'll put that in. Their question here, maybe pause it again now that you know what the question is. Your question here, which of the following could be an equation for the graph shown in the XY plane above? And they give you four equations. College Board claims they don't ask trick questions, but they do ask subtle questions that turn on the labels for a graph. So in this case, you'll notice each tick mark on the y-axis is one unit, but your tick marks on the x-axis are two units. So let's find the equation. The y-intercept is 1, 2, 3, 4. These are all slope-intercept, so it's one of the two choices where y equals mx plus b, b equals 4. So that's not choice A, and it's not choice D. All I have to do now is find the slope, since they're in slope-intercept form. My slope is the change in y, y2 minus y1, over the change in x, x2 minus x1. Finding some points, x1, y1, to this point, is x equals 0, y equals 4. 1, 2, 3, 4. I always like to count a few times. x2, y2, for this point, is 2, 4, 6, 8, 10, 12. x is 12, when y is 0. So my slope is y2 minus y1 is 0 minus 4. x2 minus x1 is 12 minus 0. So my slope is negative 4 over 12, which is negative 1 over 3. That would give me choice C as my answer. Reread the question carefully to make sure that I've answered their question correctly. I will shortly be posting a collection of videos that turn on this topic, and when I do, I'll post a link to that in the comments. Other than that, come back soon for my next math video with Math There's Always More.